My name is Dr. Nino Kuzmar, and I'm the Medical Director of St. Clair Cosmetic Clinic. Here at St. Clair Cosmetic, we specialize in non-surgical cosmetic rejuvenation and enhancement procedures for the face and neck. Okay, today we have Lynn here, and with Lynn, we're going to talk about a three-stage approach to complete facial revitalization. Stage one, we are going to do our advanced skin tightening of the jowls, the cheeks, jawline, and neck area. For that, we're going to use our profound RF device. RF microneedling in these areas, both sides, upper lip, chin, and neck area for significant deep dermal tightening, creation of collagen, elastin, and hyaluronic acid, but also with Lynn, we are going to do some spot treatment using the ablative fractional CO2, the core. Now, why will we do that? Because in the deep mode, the core itself does not ablate that much of the surface. It actually ablates very little and goes deep into the uh, dermis, enhancing and in many ways facilitating more skin tightening. The second area we're going to address with Lynn is going to be the perioral area using the blade of fractional CO2 in mid mode. Why? Because over the course of the aging process, the skin in this area becomes quite thin and you get fine vertical lines in the upper lip and in and around the mouth. And the core in the mid setting is ideal for this particular area. The third intervention using the core following our profound, will be in the periorbital area underneath the eyes, where we have fine, crepey skin that develops also as part of the aging process that is very well suited to an ablative fractional CO2 in mid-mode. So, profound RF to start, ablative fractional CO2 using the core for additional skin tightening to get an even more enhanced tightening into essentially the jowls, cheek area on both sides, followed by fine line revitalization, refining in and around the mouth area. over the next several months, our stage two intervention in her journey to facial revitalization is going to be skin refinement, further skin refinement. So our initial stage one was the tightening process with some spot resurfacing. And stage two is gonna be more focused on skin refinement and resurfacing 
However, not with an intervention with as much downtime as the first one. The first intervention was one where Lynn uh, had about seven to eight, maximum 10 days of downtime. Uh, these interventions moving forward are essentially minimal in uh, duration, maximum one to two days. So 12, week, 12 weeks after we do our initial intervention of skin tightening and spot refinement, we're going to actually do some additional resurfacing using the sublative RF. This is the only RF non-ablative resurfacing device on the market. And what we're doing here is the entry point is with tiny pinpoint entries. And then essentially the RF energy cones out into the tissue, still staying within the epidermis and more superficial dermal areas. And what is it used for? Fine lines, fine wrinkles, pore size reduction. In multiple applications over time, you can soften up uh, mild to moderate acne scars. Now, how I like to use this technology is to combine it in the same sitting with uh, PRP microneedling. And why do I like to do that? Well, because PRP microneedling with the introduction of uh, growth factors, to stimulate stem cells, really supercharges your result. You end up getting 30 to 40% better results when you combine with PRP microneedling. And with this intervention, we will be doing this 12 weeks after our initial skin tightening with the core and the profound RF. And we will have two, two sessions, six, six weeks apart. And that'll conclude and, and improve Lynn's skin to the point that we want to be at.